Oh. Uh, we're going to put spider away, simulation chambers away. Grab these suckers for now. Cannot begin... Cannot begin simulation. Missing polymer medium. Oh, right. It needs clay. Okay, I'm just going to tear those up for the time being. We're going to need more than that. Okay, so clay polymer. Polymer clay. Needs clay. Needs clay. Clay. Okay. Clay again. Speaking of... Uh, let's see. I got con contacted by Clay specifically because they offered me early access to the new update for Griftland, so I'm kind of excited for that. Alright, how much can I make? A bunch. That's good. I guess I'm going to need a couple more. Okay, so there's the overworldian matter. So, if I connect these with just basic storage connections, will it pull and push or no? Or am I going to have to have both an export and an import cable? Because I could have a storage link. Let's see, don't do it. Play super fans are bad as Borderlands 3 fans. I mean... Yeah, but that's mostly an issue for Don't Starve. I don't think I've had really a whole lot of Clay fans show up to my Riftlands series and be like, you're not doing this right. I, I think I had like one or two jerks say something or other, but that was about it. But I've I've actually been doing fips, nips, snabbits. I've been actually doing pretty well lately without attracting assholes. So I'm going to do it again. Oh, and I had a couple, I think. Oh, and I wasn't so bad, but you're right. It did. Yeah, hopefully this counts as both an input-output. And if it doesn't, I don't know. I don't think this is... I wonder if I can pull from it. Okay. I can pull from it. I don't know if it's going to pull from inventories, but at least I can do overworldly matter. Which is good. It's exactly what I need. So back to the Guardian Lily ink sack. Okay, so we've now made ink sacks. We can now make the Guardian Lily seed. At long last, we've completed a challenge. You win. I gained a prestige point. Yes! Okay, so we have one prestige point to spend on something. We can do portal gun, faster growing, mob grinder, fire resistance, 
Night vision or water breathing. These are actually pretty good. I think we want to go or excavation. It's either or excavation or fertile soil. Or we save up for the smelter. I think I'm going to skip on ore excavation. I've had a lot of people say it's good, but I just, I'm not sure how much I need it. What else do we have? Flux networks. Wireless transfer of power. I think we have another, a bunch of other things to do. There's Project E, but yeah, that's, that's later. When's the next time you're actually going to mine? It, technically, that's why I even went on this journey. Because I wanted to go mine in the, um, in the end. But I could also just not. Oh, hey. Uncrafting grinder. Okay, so we're going to need some of these. Uh, let's see. Let's take some of these off the list. Pretty much don't need the rest. We'll leave the wind generators for a bit. Okay. So black carpet. Nope. Black wool. We're very low on wool. Should have a silly amount of string at this point. Oh, I do, but it's not connected. Okay, daylight sensor. Hmm. Just gonna get a bunch of those. I don't necessarily know if they're that useful, but still. I need more obsidian. Let's see, when Wander says in the end, I get the urge to listen to Lincoln Park. And I haven't listened to Lincoln Park in ages, but I mean that shouldn't be too surprising. All right, we should just fill up on water for a bit. I used to listen to that band a lot in in middle school and a little high school, mostly middle school. Interestingly enough, I listened to them a lot in middle school and then again in college. I kind of skipped it during the high school phase. I don't know if I necessarily was much of a moody moody middle schooler or if I it just like was rather good music for the time a bit of both I know they get made fun of a lot but okay so I don't actually have to attach the pig to the treadmill I can but I don't need to oh let's see wireless charger overworld stuff building gadget and exchanger tools well let's make the uh cyclic uncrafter Music hasn't aged well. I mean, I think that's true of almost everything. Like, there's there's some songs and some bands that are eternal, but most of them are not. Okay, so we need pair of furnaces. Just make a bunch. Like, I, I honestly can't really name a whole lot of bands that are truly timeless. There are a couple that are sort of timeless in terms of, like... Okay, recipe found. Fifth element is timeless in your eyes. Fifth element creeps me out. Like, I, I like it as a movie, but Fifth Element is about a guy that effectively... Oh, hey. Let's just burn this thing up about a guy that ends up kind of in custody of well nope you cannot uncraft a treadmill hmm 
Oh, the music, not the movie. Okay. I have problems with, uh... I have problem with the fi Fifth Element movie. It... It is... I don't like it. I like the idea of it, but then I, like, start thinking about it. I'm like, holy shit, that is just, like... Just creepy. I don't want it. It's 5x5 five five and needs power. Well, it's got... Power. Or do I need to... Do I need to put something above it to make it work? Just something that I could grind up for resources. I did make a shit ton of buckets that I guess I don't need. Oh, you know what? I know what I could maybe grind up. This shit. We'll keep the battle sign and the other shuriken. But I should be able to grind all this stuff up, yeah? Might have to be full durability. I guess that makes sense. It didn't work with the uh, treadmill though, so I, I don't know. I don't really care. I was just more doing that for the novelty and the prestige points. Oh uh, god, there's a lot. There's a lot to do here. Uh, let's skip ahead maybe. Craft Dragon's Breath. Travel deep into the end void to find an end city floating ship to obtain Elytra. Oh, I should make a boat. Go do this. So Elytra is flight. That might not be a bad idea. I mean, I straight up have a waterfall right next to this, so this should work. Yeah. Ooh. That was really close to the edge. Where'd my boat go? Did it just jack my boat? Jacked my boat. Oh, there it is. What? No, I could do this. How do I get out? How do I stop being boat? C. Shift? Shift. Got it. There we go. Got my boat back. Did that count? Water has to come from an iron bucket. This is weirdly fiddly for no god goddamn reason. Alright, whatever. We're just gonna go over here. E free EXP.
Well. Yeah, it would need to be at the top. Ugh. Okay, so let's just absorb for a bit. Just grab regular buckets. There we go. That should be enough. All right, let's go back. I haven't watched the streams lately, and only one question. What kind of dark sorcery made it where you can put water in the nether? Oh, wrong one. There we go. I've still got my shuriken. I should be fine. I guess I should probably kill this sucker. Oh, that went right over the pig baby. That, that would have been bad. I wonder if it has to be a regular... I wonder if it has to be a wooden boat. Just like plain wood, nothing more? I... yeah, that's probably the case. Yeah, this is fiddly. That's how I felt like about some of these things. I I almost feel like this mod pack needs one more pass to just effectively go through the entire thing and and take a lot of the redundant metals and just kind of squish. Cuz there's a lot of there's a lot of stuff still here that kind of does the same thing. We've got several different specific uh like power generators. And I'm mostly fine with that, but it, it could be slightly better optimized for new players to, like, load into and be like, okay, do we really need all of these different metals? Some of which are generally just kind of useless. Like, tin more or less just existed for, like, two things, and then I've just been gathering it. Copper is just disappointing. Like, I, I don't even make copper wire. I make... Uh, the copper wire out of something completely different, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, well. That's fine. Boat. So, yeah. I think we just need a basic oaken boat. Because the dark oak boat is insufficient for what I'm doing. And if this doesn't work, I don't really know. And near music. A boat. Exactly. Well, I guess let's just go down. Sup, nerds? I gotta be kinda careful here. So if I hit the big men, I'm probably dead. Get wrecked, son. Yep, there we go. Hell of a boat ride. I didn't even put the boat down. But yeah, it had to be just a regular oak boat, not a uh, oak boat. An oak boat, not a dark oak boat. Oh, these shurikens actually have like a, a max level. Huh. I think there was a blaze in there, but he's gone. Okay. Well, we got that done. Exterminate the wither. Huh. And yeah, we still got to do Lost Cities of Twilight to get these things. Which means, once again, we need the Parabox. Okay, so Parabox is missing a lot. Oh.
This should be hooked up. Okay, space-time equalizer. So I think that's going to be my main issue. Okay, so we're going to need some iron. Uh, we might not. Basic energy cube. So we need more steel ingots. Okay, so we got the steel ingots. We got the basic energy cube. Advanced energy cube still needs two more of these. So we just need one more enriched alloy. Okay. Uh, you have the Lost Cities gig. I have the Lost Cities. I don't have the Twilight Forest. Metallurgic Infuser. Oh, hey, I have a bunch of these sitting around. Cool. Go back to infusing those. Okay, so we got the resources we need. So now we still need blocks of iron, and we got to go back to the space-time equalizer. It requires ender pearls, which I've got. Superconductive magnets, so we need to go back to Tritanium and Dilithium. Yeah, so I need... I need loads of Tritanium. I have Dilithium Crystals. And I have Tritanium Ore. My problem is, I'm... Betting this Tritanium Ore is insufficient for what I need. What's my iron production doing? It's doing slowly. I guess at this point, let's tear this up. I'm just going to get rid of that export cable. This is a risky maneuver, but it's fine. Okay. So I guess for starters, I don't know how that flew out of my... Oh, right. That was all downstairs. I think I might need the Crescent Hammer. Huh. That was my Obsidian Pickaxe. It lost its diamond effect. Weird. Keep expecting the vocals. You know, I do too. I'm kind of surprised. But I kind of appreciate without. As much as I love the vocals of Nier Automata, it's not as fun uh, trying to commentate over vocals, if you know what I mean. Okay, uh, let's see. go back to this. 
we've got a fair bit of iron amber still sitting around there. But what we want to do is effectively just tear up the item ducks here. They were a neat idea in the beginning, and they worked well, and I think they look better than my standard storage solution. The problem is they're just not as good. It's a slower process, and it's a worse process. And that's enough for me to want to get rid of it. Okay, so let's grab storage cables. We want import cables. Probably going to want a couple more of these. Can I make more of these? I can. We need stone slabs, though. At some point, I'll make more of those. Uh, let's see. Decent amount. So we want to do one, two... Okay, there we go. If I'm not mistaken. Oh, we've got pipe running there. Yeah, okay. Uh, let's see. So we want to do. I guess we only need one of these going through. There we go. Everything else can just kind of connect. There we go. There we go. That's good. This is kind of dumb. I'm just going to make a hole there. Uh, probably right here. Just too wide. I'm just going to use that as my pop-up pop hole. Okay, grab the grab the rest of these. Okay, I'm just gonna have these import iron. What have I done wrong? Why is this not importing? should be. It's all hooked up, yeah? So you can make teleporters to go up and down floors. Yeah, I should probably do that. Okay, seriously, why is this not working? Oh, I know why it ain't working. Because it's all in my inventory. I'm a doof. I don't know what I just put away. It might have been important. I needed exports, didn't I? I need, yeah. Sorry, the two, wait, yeah? Yeah. Okay, there we go. Now it's working. Okay, now we have a fully automated iron setup, and we can more or less use this entire thing for any other resources we want. Uh, we should probably grab more fluid ducts. Okay, fluid duct and servo. Because at this point, we want to get... We want to get a setup so we can actually service the Tritanium. Uh, 
I'm going to operate under the assumption I can just melt this down. And hope it works. Okay. Uh, let's see. Last thing. We need this number four. And yes, I'm aware that technically there's like easier ways to do everything that I'm currently doing. But that's fine. Uh, where the... Okay, there's my wrench. Oops. Turn that off. Okay. So I'm just gonna put these in. And hope that's good enough. Uh, let's see. Fluid duct. Hardened fluid ducts. Yeah, I'll probably eventually just transition entirely over to the hardened ones. Even if they're slightly less efficient. Oh, that is... That is a good sight. That is a good feeling. That lava just filling up is exactly what I need. And that's set to blacklist. Probably set the lot of them to blacklist. Okay. So, I think we're good. Now we just have to get enough tritanium. Oh, that's molten iron in there. There we go. Okay, so this is going to take forever. But if we can get the Tritanium, what I'm thinking is we get... What I'd like to do... Tritanium ore... Specifically to washing factory. Raw ore meat. Gross. Yeah, I want to take a look at Tritanium truffles. How much Tritanium do I need? I need a whole type Tritanium block to get this. And then we need dirt and a tin bucket. But yeah, I'd, I'd like to convert my pigs over to Tritanium pigs so I don't have to go out mining for it. And then we'll do the same thing with Dilithium. Question is... Okay, so di Dilithium crystal. We can... Interestingly enough, get dilithium resource hogs. Okay, so lithium cannot be turned into dilithium. We have to get lithium and dilithium buckets. Ah, but we can actually just make a dilithium bucket of mud immediately. Uh, let's see, do we want to just make like a silly amount of regular buckets? I realize this is kind of a foolish use of resources. That's okay. Dilithium. Dirt. Dilithium crystal. Okay. Dilithium. Bucket of mud. Alright, cool. So we might not actually have to go back. I'm going to need another pig, though. Okay. So we now have a Dilithium resource hog. And let's go back and hopefully we got enough Tritanium. And then that would, all that would leave is just regular Lithium. Oh, please tell me that's not nearly enough. Damn it. So we're going to have to go back to the Lost Cities. At least we could, we have a Dilithium Hog. Uh, I guess let's just grab, grab this for a bit. Let's just corn explosion for a bit. Let's see. Do you need them on stone? Oh, that's a good point. I don't know what the stone is about.
Oh, let's see. Let's grab stone. And hoe. It says no diggable block and stone. Okay, there we go. Cannot dig here. No diggable block, stone. What? Do I need more stone than this? Okay, uh... We'll do fence. Do we think stone or cobblestone? Because I honestly can't... can't decide which it needs. I guess we'll give it both. We'll start with regular stone. And then we'll try the other stuff. Okay, regular stone. No diggable block, stone. Okay, can dig, can dig for truffles. Okay, so we just have to let him go for a while. Then we'll have to get one more pig. Yeah, I don't think they destroy the blocks. They didn't earlier when I just had a basic cobblestone pig. And then I realized cobblestone pigs are silly and I don't need them. Okay. Anyway, I'm going to just put these things away. We're... We're on our way, but I'm going to have to go back to the Lost Cities, and that's going to take a considerable amount of time to get going. This this little sucker will slowly produce truffles, and we're probably going to want to make at least a couple more resource pigs. I, was, I really wish I could make uh, dilithium saplings, but that's just, that's just not a thing, and that's, that's a darn shame.